Hi guys, we've got a whole batch of new today. This is a appreciation shave for Steve Mendel. Stick around. Hi guys, thank you for joining me for another shave and scent of the day. Uh, big shout out um, for this shave goes to Steve Mendel. Um, he supplied most of this shave. Um, <clears throat> I had not tried, I, I was on the Artisan Spotlight um, with um, Johnny from uh, Luther, 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 Luther Grooming, um, and Steve Mendel uh, did this as a giveaway for me. So Luther, 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 Luther Calm. I've got the matching splash. And then, very excited about this, the uh, Daily Hydrating Gel Moisturizer, which I've been using this some, um, and I, I love it, uh, but I haven't used it after a shave yet, so I like to see how, how that works. Um, this is brush that Steve bought me a while back from Trotter Handcrafts. It's one of my very favorite brushes, so beautiful. And I've already got it loaded up, you know, to save a minute. Weapon of the day, Jim Micromatic Open Comb with a PTF or P PTFE, a Teflon coated blade, Jim blade. And this one is just you. Ugh. Just open it up, put your blade in. Can't see that well. Let's see. Yeah, that's better, kind of. All right, um, and then you just tighten her down. So that's what we're going with today, an open comb because. I have a lot of growth. I'm not even sure how much it is at this point. Um, let's see, we'll go this way. Um, and then we'll be using our extremely bougie spa water in the beautiful silver canister. Why did I get it? I don't know. This one is starting to clog up a little bit. Um, and I did spray some vinegar and water through there and it helped it out some, but I, you know, I feel like the days are, are limited on this. The days are numbered. Um, this little bottom piece right here keeps popping out too. Um, and the, let's see, right there on the spring, that keeps popping out. So eventually I'm sure that's going to break. So I went ahead and got set up extremely bougie style. Cheers. Happy Friday, everyone. This is a um, Woodford um, Reserve Double Oat um, that I'm having with this shave today. So cheers. It is my day off today as I work this weekend. So of course we're gonna get in a nice shave. Um, I've got, I had a little bitty pimple right here and I scratched it and somehow I scratched off a layer of skin. So this has been bothering me for a few days. So I don't know how shaving is gonna go around that. Um, I may have to kind of limit that, but we'll see. We shall see. Mm, that is extremely bougie water. I can tell. Luscious. It's luscious. I um, haven't used this one in a good while. This razor. Um, and I enjoy it. Actually, I've only used it just a couple of times, I think. Um, I just, I don't use my single edges nearly as much as anything else. You know, unless you want to call a straight edge, or a straight edge a single edge, which technically it is a single edge, but... You don't really consider it um, when you're talking about SE razors. Um, straight razor doesn't really come up in that conversation. So anyway, let's get going. I stayed up late last night because the men's basketball balls were playing in the Sweet 16 and they choked it out. I, um, hopefully in the off season they learn how to how to shoot free throws. You know it's it's a free shot. Um, you got to be able to make some of those. And so once again, they go out too early. And FAU goes to the Elite Eight. I don't even know who FAU is. Florida Atlantic, um, whoever that is. But somehow they come for like a. I don't know, 11 seed or something, and now they're in the Elite Eight. So kudos to them. 
and poo-poo to the Vols for not hitting free throws. And they're definitely going to lose some talent over the offseason, so don't know what the immediate future holds for the Vols. Mm, beautiful lavender scent on this. This one is calm, and lavender is known to make you calm. And that would be good for me if that happens today. Bourbon might have something to say about that, too. Mm, beautiful, beautiful stuff. We'll get plenty of water in here. For plenty of slickness with that open comb. I remember it being a quite efficient razor. Which will be good with how much growth I have today. And I think we're good here. It's plenty shiny. It's dripping off of my brush. See it's starting to diarrhea at the bottom. I think we're good. A little bitter tasting. Um, we'll give that a 2.97 on the tasteometer. Yeah, you got that. 2.97. I don't know what that means. It means... Cheers, mate. I really enjoy this whiskey wisdom glass. However, it doesn't ding. So that's a that's a negative one for that. Um, off of the phone. What, Jackson? I, I want to be this person, but I can't. I'm sorry. I don't know how to help you. If you need me to shave that person, I can do that. Because that's what I'm doing right now. Okay. Have fun. All right. Warmed up the blade a little bit. And let's get going. See how this guy will take off. I don't know how, maybe a week's worth of growth. I don't know. Come on, come on, bombs away. Yep, seems to have done the trick. can't remember what BBS live week it is at this moment. I don't think it's, I think Badger week is done. Um, I don't know. I'm behind on everything this week. It's been a super busy week. We had um, our accreditation um, team come in to evaluate the hospital this week so you know just to getting ready for for that and you know it's they ask you a bunch of questions so you have to be ready and so it's a little a little stressful getting ready even though you know we're already good from the start it's not like we have to do a bunch of stuff but it's just you know just the answering questions and stuff that you hope that you have the right answers or you hope whatever they ask you, you, you know, you're ready for. Mmm. Really nice lavender scent on this. Not sweet, but not um, acrid either. Though sometimes the lather can get pretty, pretty in your face or on your face. <laughs> Excuse that one. Uh, but this one is nice. You know, I wouldn't call it sweet, but I wouldn't call it really bitter either. The flavor is a little on the bitter side, so if you don't like that, then don't eat your lather.
But if that sounds like your cup of tea, then pour it in. Woo. That one fell right on me. Nice efficiency on this razor. I mean, it's already nice and uh, smooth. This is where I don't love the gym razors as much um, as in the, the really coarse hair. I would like to find something a little sharper than these PTFE. And I know um, a lot of different, there's a lot of different branding for these same blades. Um, I believe these were branded Persona. I'm not positive. It's been a long time since I've bought them, since I purchased them. I mean, you can see where there's a little drag there, trying to get through that much hair. You know, and this is even an open comb. And it's still not the smoothest going through there. I also won't say that I'm, you know, the best straight edge shaver in the world either. Because I don't do it that often. But I know enough to get a good shave and I think maybe that's all you have to know. All right, here we go. Through, I can see that skin still there. Oh. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and drain, drain the basin for this because that was a lot of hair. But I mean, it's pretty good already. I mean, I'm sure I could go you know, one more pass, basically north to south, and it would probably be fine. I'm certainly not planning on going south to north right there. I can tell you that. Really nice lather. Just holds so much water. Seems like you can't kill the soap. How about a little more? of water in there just extreme shine look at that Luther makes some of the most beautiful lather oh man there's so much hair in here right. give this a little rinse wow pretty efficient razor does a very good job really neat looking razor too in my opinion I didn't give your opinion because I don't know it, but I'm gonna guess that you love it too. All right. Let's keep it going.
really rigid blades on these. Not like the super thin DE blades at all. These provide a totally different feel. Try to be extremely careful about how much pressure I use. I mean, these things don't bend. Very nice shaver. Just wish there were more gem blades on the market. Definitely still a little skin hanging off of there. There you go. I think I got it. Yes, Jackson. Mm-hmm. I'm playing a game on Roblox. Well, I watched a video where, mm -hmm. where they were in here, and now I'm in there. Are you kidding me? Yeah. They were in there, and now you're in there? Yeah, but... I don't even know what to think about that. That is incredible. the adoption center guy... The adoption center? Are you being adopted? No. Oh. His, his name is Tad, but Tad. he isn't here anymore. Oh, Tad's gone? Hmm. Yeah. Because I don't see him anymore. Well, I guess there's a tad less of Tad there, right? <laughs> All right, then. Glad you guys got that story. I think you understood it as much as me. All right, let's do a little more work. Let's just get this a little closer. It's already smooth, but when you can get it smoother, why not? I ain't working today. I ain't got nothing to do. I'm going to get shaved today. Mm-hmm. There we go. I swear you got to be careful about that angle. I mean, you always do, but especially here. All right, let's see.
I know I'm stupid. Right, we'll do just a little quick, a little quickie. Everybody likes a little quickie, right? Of course. Get those tough areas. Yep, that's going to do it. Another great shave. I don't think I'm ready to go back to work tomorrow yet. It's tough when you just get one day off. You know, when you don't get two consecutive days off, let me put it that way. If you have anything you need to get done, you just can't rest. Residual slickness on this soap is killer. It's excellent. Uh, itchy nose. gone now it's under my fingernail all right we got that all done now after shave time oh i didn't i didn't even show what my scent of the day is it is the um call the island lavender that jason at the razor company was so nice to gift me thank you so much jason really nice stuff for those of you that haven't seen that before it's what reserve lavender or well now it's just lavender from barrister and man is that scent is based off and i don't believe you can get it anymore so i don't use it that much because i don't want to go through it really Really nice lavender, though. Really super smooth, citrusy lavender. Mm. This one is really nice, too. All right. I think we're good there. First, I'm going to add a few drops of C Tetra Vitamin C Serum from Medicaid been enjoying this stuff too feel like it it's helping my skin i do six drops and then just kind of rub it through really nice light oil soaks in almost immediately get that on that lip see if we can get some healing on there all right wash my hands off quickly I'm gonna go ahead and wash my rinse my brush out while that soaks into my skin 
Then we'll move on to the moisturizer and scent of the day. Which I am excited for both. This uh, moisturizer is not greasy at all. Um, soaks in really quickly. I haven't had any skin troubles from it or anything like that. So impressed with it so far. I just haven't used it after a shave yet. Knock a little of that water out. And hang it up where my last brush was. Which is my kingpin from Bobby Muffet from last shave. Got too much stuff. I'm running out of places to put everything. All right. It's really nice stuff. It's in a cool glass jar uh, with a kind of bendable plastic top. And there's the beautifulness right there. And I just kind of get some and just put some strategic dots around my face. And then rub it on in really does not take a lot of this stuff. It's really good. Little goes a long way. This thing should last a good amount of time. Once again, not greasy or oily feeling at all. Unscented. I'm feeling luxurious right now. Luxurious. There's some lusciousness going on in my skin. All right. And now with another blast of lavender. Mm-hmm. Man, that is so fresh. So fresh and so plain, plain. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Cheers. Hope you have a fantastic weekend. Hope you get some good time in with your family and friends. And I will see you on the next one.